my darling! Welcome to my channel. I'm your favorite actress, Sita Yatuda, again with a new pickup powder. And you already know, today we're going to be knowing that what your future spouse will whisper in your ears at the highest peak of their passion. Okay? So when they're doing it with you, you know that stuff. <laughs> and at the highest peak of their passion, when they're like, Oh my god they're losing all control like almost they are in the mid heaven okay so what they will whisper in your ears if they want to whisper anything then what will they say to you so if you are in this video you're clicking on this video then definitely your future spouse will whisper something into you into your ears that's why you are in this video that's why spirits are guiding you to listen some messages as a preview of your future time so my darling if you're new to my channel have no idea what is going on let me tell you i am an intuitive territory use my intuition and magical power to channel message from angels and universe to guide your guys is purely intuitive best reading my darling so trust your intuition and trust your gut feelings in order to choose the perfect group for yourself so let me pick three cards for my three beautiful groups so my group number one things are not as they appear okay so this is a beautiful message card the message from universe so things are not as they appear this is my group one group number two is convince yourself not others group number three is sometimes the good is hidden okay so my darling you can okay let me give you a beautiful closure look where you can pause the video and choose the proper group whichever you are drawn to listen to intuition and choose the group through you through your intuition and if you're drawn to more than one group feel free to choose this group my darling maybe you got some extra messages from angels and universe so my darling let's go I hope my darling you choose the perfect group for yourself i'll give the timestamps in the description box so go there click on the timestamps and the video will give you the exact timing when your pile is going to be started and my darlings if you're new to my channel then go away subscribe to my channel and also hit that bell icon so that you're notified by youtube whenever i upload new videos so let's go jump into your reading hello my darlings my cuties my babies you choose the group number one things are not as they appear okay so first of all my darling group number one you're going to marry someone very much an expected person in your life this is a hint you choose this group so this card is going to give you some message about your future spouse some message about your love connection the love that you're going to have or maybe you already have and that will de develop more deeper through time so things are not as they appear so you're going to marry someone but at first you will meet them and you will feel like maybe they are in a relationship maybe they are not available to you maybe they got another person but it's not true so some false situation you will face at the at the first meeting or the initial part of the meeting okay so also my darling i'm getting that it's kind of like coyote energy, coyote spirit animal. So, gift through disguise. Yes, that can happen. So, sometimes when darling, you just meet someone and at that day, you are just having very uh, much headache and hectic. But at the end of the day, you'll find out that that person is your savior or that person really plays a great important role in your life. Things are not as they appear. So right now, maybe you are in a situation that you don't see anyone in your life as your potential have your wifey, but things are not as they appear, okay? So you really don't see that what's coming for you next. So be ready for an expected surprise, my darling. So what the card is telling you, the lower the price of your love, the higher its value brain freeze the universe wow it feels like my group number one let me tell you one thing this is a riddle kind of a card the lower the price of your love that means someone will fall for you 
when you are not giving them some attention when you are not talking to them for any long term connection and when you are least expecting from that person you are really lowering your price of your attention uh, when it comes to this person so at the first meeting with your future spouse you're not going to give them attention you're not going to pay any extra attention to them because you don't see anything that is coming for the future with this person so that's why my darling the message is things are not as they appear okay things happen quickly and expectedly like magic wow that's beautiful so let's go find out my darling at the peak of their highest passion highest emotion what will they whisper into your ears let's go find out Three guides, my guardian angel, Archangel Michael Maharso, channel message to me for my beautiful group number one. But what is the message for my beautiful group number one? For my group number one, speak guides. Why do I feel like your person is very dirty? <laughs> you know, my darling, dirty in a way that your person is very naughty and they can really make anything sexier than usual your person got that talent okay they can really make anything more naughtier more hotter and more sexual than other other people okay like your person have that quality they got that naughtiest mind okay so let's go find out my darling what is there for you you got the wow queen of sword you got the king of sword wow queen of sword king of sword you guys are perfectly divine counterpart both of you got the same stamina same kind of vibe okay soulmate vibe empress wow you got the three of pentacles so cute you got the what is this five of wands in reverse and you got the Knave of Wands, that is Page of Wands. Okay. Five of Wands in reverse. Oh my God. The first and foremost beautiful positive thing in your relationship is there is no third party. There is no third party. There is no third wheeling in your connection. Only you and your person. So no mind blockages. That's the best card about it. Okay. So yeah. Let's go find out what your person will whisper. First thing they will whisper that you test amazing. Okay. By number one, your person will say that something about your test. Why I'm talking about test? Because three of pentacles here, I can see the kitchen. I can see that a man is lifting his woman into his arms and kissing passionately. So this energy is kind of giving me the test, you know, using the tongue and kissing. And while kissing you, after kissing you, your person will whisper into you, into your ears that you taste so good. Something about, you know, your person will use their tongue to test you. Yeah, they are into those lick. Yes. <laughs> oh my God, this person is all into like, I want to test you. So this person will love to lick you or every time... They kiss you no matter where, okay? It's maybe they're very gentle. They're kissing your, this area, okay? And your person will slightly use their inner lip and tongue to test you or to like, yeah. Like they'll have to trace your body with their lips. So first thing they will whisper that you test so good. Like you taste like yummy, 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 cheesy. <laughs> oh my God. Second thing is your person will whisper into, into your ears. You know, like words like I'm only yours. I'm having my eyes only on you. There is nobody but you. Because King of Sword is very loyal person. King of Sword is also the energy that your person got lots of suitors. Even after marriage, people will approach your future spouse so many times and your, your new person is like kicking them out from their life. Like definitely they're kicking them. Can you see that? They're kicking them. So you don't have to worry about their character. You don't have to have any kind of trust issue with this person. Okay? So King of Sword, they will say that 
you don't have to worry about my loyalty i am into you i'm interested in you i'm invested in you i only love you i have only one heart and that one heart is yours okay i have my feelings only on you only for you my heart my soul my love the money i earn the respect i earn all the love whatever belongs to me that belongs to you that is a kind of a vibe also queen of sword your person love to see you whenever you are like applying cream on your body or tying your hair or applying hair serum on your hair or doing some skin routine your person oh my god they get so turned on whenever you are like prepping yourself like skin prepping time your person can see you and suddenly they will walk to the mirror exactly where you are sitting and they will lean on you and they will whisper in your ears that stop making yourself so delicious i am dying to eat you i'm so hungry so yeah some eating vibe why i'm getting those eating vibe i don't know in fact in this empress card empress means harvest empress means like they are putting you to the pedestal at the same point of time they are superly positive towards you can you see the snake i don't know if you can see okay i cannot show you the cards because these cards are kind of like erotic uh, images are there but still let me now let me tell you what i can see i can see that a woman is sitting that is you no matter who you are man woman doesn't matter it's just the energy so you are sitting and your person is like the big neck behind that is protecting this figure that is you so your person will protect you like yeah people got eyes on you and your person can see but you cannot see maybe you are not interested in other anymore other men and women you feel like that there is no connection anymore but your person can see that people are looking at you people are wanting your attention and they will whisper into you ears that stop making yourself so acxy out there okay because i don't want you to look so good because people are drooling over you okay they are not narcissistic they are not someone that they are trying to hide you or keep you like a secret asset no they just telling these things like um from a from a very possessive heart from a very protective heart that please don't make yourself so beautiful out there okay like you can really wear anything in front of me but whenever you're going out be very mindful whatever you're wearing or whatever you're showing to others because people are drooling over you so i can feel my group number 1 your person can sense like if you're a female watching for a male so your husband can sense that other male or if you are a male watching for females then your wife can sense that other women are drooling over your body i don't know my darling that how you perceive yourself but when it comes to your future spouse they see you very attractive maybe you don't even know that how much attractive you are because nobody ever told you nobody ever like confessed that how much attractive you look whenever you go outside okay look beautiful people are not attractive but some attractive people have seen that you cannot measure their eyes or nose but they are superly attractive it's like magnetism in their character you got it okay also also my darling with the knave of wands they are very childish so your person will also tickle you a lot like they will tickle you and whisper into your ears that can you dance with me okay let's go dance on the bed <laughs> let's go dance in our ecstasy oh my god i want to dance with you i love it when you are jumping on me okay any time okay like whenever you are jumping on me when you are like attacking me with your kisses with your hugs with your innocent affection i feel so happy i feel so lucky 
also your person will whisper that don't don't worry prince or princess i'm only yours no one can have me hmm. also like before having any child your person can definitely will you know whisper into your ears that let's go make a baby or it's time for a baby making let me cook for you okay <laughs> so yeah no matter who they are male female doesn't matter whoever you're watching your person will whisper into your ears that i will make a baby let's go cook together <laughs> let's go do things together okay because i can see both of you are making something so delicious i don't know if you are into cooking or your person like one of you or maybe both of you are into cooking or love to cook or love for a cook is here so kitchen um sex is here okay like in the kitchen you guys are doing it and your person is whispering that what do you want baby okay let me put some cheese on you let me put some honey on you let me put some uh, spice on you because i love it when you're spicy like spicy hot okay <laughs> what is there Okay, five of ones in reverse your person is very private so they will never do things outside so they are not pda okay they are not into pda they're very private in a way they're very shy to show their naughty side in front of other people okay so let's go find out some more let's go find out some more Self-love. You realize that love of self is necessary to love another. Wow. My group number one, whoever you're watching, your self-love will increase and increase in next level with your future spouse. Also, your future spouse will love themselves because they know that if they want to become a great lover, they need to have self-love, self-appreciation, or self-care, skin routine, health routine, health care. Self-care is very much needed. Wow, self-love is there. And whenever there is self-love in a connection, oh my God, that is the best thing ever. You got the action. You have the courage to express the unique loving colors of your soul. Okay, so both of you are very much action-oriented. In this connection, in this relationship, both of you are very much expressive and express your feelings in a very creative way. So whatever your person feel like, they will tell you, they will show you, they will find a way to tell you. So they, like your future spouse really don't know how to suppress their feelings. Of course, no one should suppress their feelings, but your person definitely, they're so action oriented that they will definitely find a way to show you that how much they love you or how much, um, they have that protective power on you well you got the vow i shuffled in front of you <laughs> you got the vow they're super duper loyal they will keep their promises okay their words are not just only words it's their rules regulation it's their law it's their heart and soul let me tell you one thing your person is like oh my god they're amazing Oh my god you can count on them the vow it's all about whatever they will say to you whatever words coming out of their mouth those are not only words those are action those are the two the truest form of their love it feels like whatever they say they will do that okay whatever they say they will do that okay so whatever they will tell you before marriage they will do that to you in 18 plus stuff also in uh, general lifestyle whatever they say they do that okay they don't lie your person is not a liar not even not even a bit because the vow card also shows that whatever they will be saying to you they will be very much mindful of whatever they're saying okay you got the apocalypse 
okay i hope i'm pronouncing it right if i'm pronouncing it wrong i'm sorry my darling okay but this is a card of underworld connection or connecting with their darkness to get that heroic power so your person is someone they are like they know those survival qualities like they can um defend their physical body they know that judo karate boxing or they just know how to protect themselves yeah your person is someone they are the dark one the dark one in the sense that you are falling in love with a villain you know those villain love story yes look they are not villain they are not like villain like um <laughs> killing other people or doing negative stuff to other people no your person is not like that but your person is going to be the villain of those bad people who are breaking rules or giving other people hard time difficult times your person kill those negative people by possessing those um dark qualities in them it feels like they may be into police army justice detective um they may be into spy uh they may be into like hacking ethical hacking or some protection background or some protective background like cyber crime or they may be like a doctor okay they may be someone like in in a, in a security team okay yeah some security team some secure things are going on like whatever they do they secure some people secure project secure um like online security yeah but it is the vibe like they can kill people if that is their job to secure positivity or if that is uh the case that they need to do in order to um sustain their positive life yeah wow so they will whisper things like yeah oh my god these two cards are coming so they will whisper things like i can kill anybody to save you i can go to any extent to be with you or i will kill you if you look at any other people okay now this is a kind of like triggering point but you know my darling they love you so much that they just don't know how to live without you look i'm not being cheesy i'm just telling you whatever the cards are telling me okay and the dead end wow the dead end talks about that your person will meet you after seeing or after feeling lots of exhaustion or rejection in their life so it feels like you are their dead end or you are their life like you are their last love yeah that's the vibe you are their last love they don't see anybody after you after having you like they they lost the interest in other women or other men yeah that that end it feels like the searching is now end they can sense it they can feel it so that's all i got for you my group number 1 i hope you enjoyed this reading so my darling give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my channel hit that bell icon if you haven't already till then stay blessed and happy i love you so much hello my darling it's amazing group number 2 welcome 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 so you choose the card that is convince yourself not others so what this card is telling you First of all my darling you choose this card and that card is going to tell you something about your love life about your future spouse or the love that you're about to get or maybe you already have it if you are like in a condition or in a situation like you know who is the person that you're going to marry uh for you and also for the singles um mm, the vibe I'm getting that you are going to marry someone very confident revolutionary powerful they are here to break rules and make new rules they are here to convince themselves to to you know spread self love and love themselves and saying bye bye to the toxic people they are very motivational so convince yourself not others that means if you want to have a perfect connection perfect sustainable relationship you know then let me tell you one thing convince yourself 
tell yourself that what you want to have you don't have to say to others you don't have to tell others that please be loyal to me or else i will leave you don't say this kind of words to anybody if someone wants to be loyal towards you they will be okay you don't have to say that to things okay you don't have to say these things to anybody so convince yourself Help yourself to grow. You don't need to tell other people to grow. You don't need to tell other people that what you want. So you will get the ready-made person by the God. Okay, you don't need to uh, change a person or make a person as your dream one. And that's your blessing, my darling, my group number two. That universe will already giving you the ready-made have your wifey that exactly like your uh, choice, that exactly like your dream type, that exactly like you want it. That you can adjust your life with. That you can balance your life with. So you don't need to have anybody that you're going to be making all the change or like helping them to change into a better person. No, you don't have to do that. Already a better person entering in your life. If you change yourself into a better person, you will attract a better person. So convince yourself, make yourself your dreamy type so that you can attract your perfect partner. So... The need to clarify, explain or justify oneself in personal relationship is always self-serving. What's important is knowing the truth about why you felt the need because it often points to insecurities that could be dealt with in more effective ways. Hi ho the universe. That's beautiful my darling. So like you don't need to explain yourself to the people who don't listen to you it's because if someone wants to to understand you you don't need to explain them because they don't need to know all the stuff because they trust you and if someone don't trust you and don't try to understand you whatever you explain they are not going to believe you so don't exaggerate your energy on something that has no value that don't give you value the person those don't give you value okay so convince yourself not others maybe that is very much important message for you my darling maybe sometimes you give so much important to other people that you forgot to give yourself importance you're explaining yourself you're clarifying your point of view to others who are not exactly interested in you or who don't really give you the perfect value that you deserve okay so let's go find out my darling that means my darling you're going to have someone who deserve you and who just don't need an explanation for whatever you do okay because they trust you so yeah a person who can just read your mind read your thoughts that is a very strong connection entering in your life where you don't need to convince your person anymore they're already convinced they're already impressed they're already loved okay so let's go find out that at the highest peak of their passion what will your future spouse whisper into your ears? Okay. Speak guides, my guardian angel, Archangel Michael Maharsal, channel message to me for my beautiful group number two. And what's coming here for my beautiful group number two? Okay. It's coming for you, my darling. That's coming for you. Okay, so let's go find out. So you got the wow nine of wands beautiful you got the nine of wands you got the knight of wands lots of fire energy you got the six that is lovers you got the wow card number nine that is hermit you got the three of wands and you got the knight of cups two knights wow very charming okay first of all my darling i can feel that your future spouse miss you so much the hermit card in a relationship whenever i get it feels like they're missing you um or they will miss you every time of course my singles or in a relationship no matter what your situation right now let me tell you one thing your future spouse at their highest peak of their emotion of their passion they will whisper into ears that i miss you i missed you so much okay every time we are separated temporarily maybe for my work for your work 
I miss you so much. I miss your energy. I miss your touch. I miss our naughty time. Okay? Because your person missed you so much. So they will carry some uh, something that is important to you. They will carry that stuff with them whenever they are traveling or whenever they are going somewhere. So expect um, a relationship that is entering in your life that will be initially long distance. Because I, I got the nine of wands and I got the knight of wands. Knight of wands is someone who is very passionate, very loving. They believe in dating, long, you know, a long drive and really having very romantic drive while um, going somewhere. Also, knight of cups, this person is someone they're entering in your life with a love offer. Okay, so they will whisper at the point of time, okay. Maybe you guys are really doing stuff together like showering together, okay? Also dancing together, going out together. Uh, you are sitting, if you are a female watching my video, you are sitting on your husband's lap. Or if you are the male watching my video, then your wife will sit on your, on your lap. And if you are like bi, gay, lesbian or trans or whoever. So when the feminine person is sitting on the masculine one then both of you will really communicate heart to heart with a very seductive voice okay when both of you really um exchange very seductive very romantic very cheesy and very like 18 plus kind of words um, so what they will Okay, the, the words that they might whisper into your, into your ears that is like, I miss you, I miss your touch, I miss your smell, I miss you so much. Oh my God, we should have made earlier. Why did you come into my life? Why did you come into my life so late? Oh my God, I want to kiss you. Or they will whisper like, you look so good today. Or uh, they will whisper like, can I enter? <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Can I do that? Or can I enter um, in you or something? Or can I ride on you? Because the Knight of Wands is here. So it's kind of like a riding vibe. <laughs> oh my God. Also the Nine of Wands is here. Nine of Wands talks about like... um. Also, they will ask you many questions because nine of ones, they are dedicated. So they will ask you that, um, did you look for me? Did you miss me? Uh, there was a person looking at you. So did you feel anything with that person? So yeah, like I don't know, but they will try to tease you. Like they will whisper something that can, that can be triggering sometimes. And they're very teasing, like they love to tease you. Or they will love to tell about the plans, that what they're going to do to you next. Three of Wands talks about expansion. Three of Wands talks about, like they will whisper something that will expand later. Okay? Or they will talk about some expansion, some story. So definitely your person will whisper that what they want to do to you. Oh my god. Also my group number two, only for your pile I'm getting that um, you guys are really having a very, very romantic and horny talk over the phone late night. Okay. And your person will whisper, okay, of course you guys are talking over the phone. So, you know, when someone is talking over the phone and someone is whispering so they will whisper some very um 18 plus stuff naughty stuff into your ears and let me tell you one thing you guys are physically not together but oh my god the way you guys are communicating it feels like they are into your, into the next room you can feel their touch even you guys are not together, okay, physically, but you can sense their touch, the way they communicate with you, the way uh, explicitly they explain that what they're going to be do, what they're going to 
be doing to you what they're going to do to you next to your ones also when you guys are together your person will whisper into your ears that i want to do that i want to do this okay so yeah like telling you the the, the whole story into your ears and they also love like ear lock biting or sucking the ear because i'm just i'm just looking at the knight of wands i don't know knight of wands it's, it's exactly i i know this is the video about what your person will whisper into your ears at their highest peak of passion and exactly this person is whispering something to their to his partner's ears while riding the horse so expect my darling this person will whisper a lot of things into your ears uh, while doing the sex with you oh wow also knight of cups they're very romantic <laughs> also it feels like my darling every time you go for shower your person is sometimes wait for you to come and smell your freshness or they will join you definitely they are very clingy i can feel so they will try to join you and sometimes you're feeling shy and telling them that no it's me time just go outside i'm coming and then you feel very much hard that oh my god that person just oh, my baby wanted to join me okay okay no come here okay so let's go get something more Also, your person will definitely whisper bad what they want you to do to them. Like they will love to command you sometimes. Like they're really showing their dominance on you by whispering things into your ears. That do this, do that. Yes, yeah, this is right. Do it, do this. Okay. Okay. Willingness. You are able to compromise if the end result is love. Yes. In this connection, definitely both of you are going to be doing many things if the end result is amazing, if the end result is beautiful, happy, then you guys are able to do anything, able to compromise anything and that's how the love and relationship works. If the end result is happiness, then you guys can adjust with each other so politely. Joy, you delight in the love of life and bring a spirit of fun to all that you do. So this is a very joyful connection, my group number two that you be in, in with your person. So your person is someone that they live in the present moment and they just give you the highest joy and happiness and laughter. So they are going to be a personal comedian. So they're like, you know, just making you laugh making you happy giving you the free freedom the free space where you can spread your wings <laughs> also love yourself okay the joy is here in this relationship also oh wow you got the alethea alethea talks about justice alethea talks about the yin and yang it's about balance okay so in this relationship nothing is imbalanced everything is imbalanced so you guys will never run out of balance if you feel like that you guys are becoming more materialistic then someone will balance with spirituality and if you guys are becoming super super duper spiritual then someone will really balance um uh when it comes to this materialistic world so the balance will there in this connection nothing is going to be uh superly like beak that can serve that can surpass all the stuff that's beautiful my darling okay because it talks about balance it, it talks about that balancing things out you know my darling when the love is very much consistent and strong when the foundation is strong then the love that you really show each other in the first day that remains same till the last day but if you are imbalanced then at the initial of the relationship becomes like 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 a love bomb like everything is true everything is magical the same that after one two years things really go from top to the bottom okay because you don't know how to balance things right 
So yes, my darling, but your relationship will, will remain same, so much consistent. Like the same type of excitement will be there at the end of the day when you guys, like one of you will die. Oh my God, I don't want to talk about this day right now. So you got that temple, spirituality, that's beautiful. Both of your spiritual, maybe some witches are also watching my video. Or your person is a witch, okay, psychic, someone who connect with higher self, God, do tarot or meditation. The temple talks about connecting with spirituality, connecting with God, doing some rituals. Wow. Be casting a spell. In this relation in this relationship there will be lots of divine intervention going on. Or you will feel like that the more you pray, the more you worship to the God, the more your relationship becomes stronger and powerful. And I can see the leaves. Leaves talks about growth. It talks about greenery, freshness, growth. A uh, place to grow, place to um, become like an ever time learner, like a like like a, like that ever student. Then you got the venom, and that's the beauty. The venom talks about the toxicity that both of you will acknowledge in each other, and that's the beauty. Like in this connection, everyone got some negative vibes, negative traits, right? But in this connection, you will try to heal your future spouse's negative traits. Your ne negative traits, your person will try to heal your negative traits. Both of you are very much flexible and open enough to show each other's negative and dark side. And that's the beauty in this connection. Like both of you are not pretending to be someone else and trying to hide their dark side. No. In this connection, you are showing your dark side as well as your person is showing their dark side. And that's the venom energy. Like feeling very much open. Like like a, like a child is very much open to show their shit to their mother. And that's the vibe that you will feel. Your person will feel very much open to show their dark side, to show their weak point to you. Because both of you knows that no nobody is going to judge each other. And that's why you got the shaman. I told you, someone is very much psychic in 2D watching my video. Shaman also talks about this connection will be strong as diamond. I can see the diamond. The snake is there. It's going to be healing. The skeleton is here. It's going to be spiritual. Maybe reincarnation is also here. It's divinely protected. I can see the evil eye as well as I can see the golden pearl that talks about the richness and money. And your person is connecting with you in... Husband or wife is connecting with you in soul level, in 5D level. If you are single watching my video also, you guys are star seed. Whoever connecting with this person, okay? I mean, both of you are star seed or this is a connection that a star seed usually have. That's all I got for you, my beautiful group number two. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Give it a thumbs up. Also, my darling, subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell icon if you haven't already. Till then, stay blessed and happy. I love you, my darling, so much. Hello, my beautiful group number three. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So you got this amazing card that is sometimes the good is hidden. Okay? So what this card really means, is this card really going to tell something about the love, the connection that you're about to have with your future spouse. Also, something about the love connection about your future husband or future wife. So something, the, the, sometimes the good is hidden. Yes. Yes, my group number three. Maybe you don't see your future spouse right now. Maybe you don't know who this person is. Maybe you are single. Maybe you are in a relationship, but you're not sure. But if that is the person that you're about to marry or not in the future, then the thing is hidden from you. There is a reason. Wait for the divine timing. If you are not ready to see the good or see the goodness in anyone or in any situation, then wait for the divine timing because sometimes the good is hidden that is good for you that is very much important for you because god made you this way so a person is entering a situation is coming the love is coming that is very good that is very beautiful and high vibrational love that is very much like a reach and abundant but you cannot see all those potential at the at the first point of time because you are not meant to see these things at the initial stages, okay? 
and he got this amazing message that is find the good in what uh, find the good in what they said or ask it's always there even if they didn't mean for it to be there sure lucky yours the universe clues for what you want are hidden all around you for some of you my parliamentary you know who your future spouse is but sometimes you just sometimes you get distracted by many things sometimes you feel like you don't know them sometimes you feel like you know them sometimes you feel like oh this is my future spouse and sometimes you're like no this is not my person so yeah sometimes the good is hidden maybe pile number three for many of you your future spouse is very much close to you very much close to you maybe you got a very fine connection with them very thin connection is there but you are not meant to find this person at this point of time because it is hidden from you but the connection is very much close you and your future spouse both of you are very much close okay physically you guys are very much close so my darling if you are in a relationship maybe this is your future spouse but sometimes you have a like skeptical feeling about this person so yeah sometimes the good is hidden let's go find out my beautiful group number three but what will your future spouse whisper in your ears at the peak of the passionate moment okay spirit guides my garden angel archangel michael mahar so channel this to me for my beautiful group number three what is there what what will they whisper into your ears okay what will they whisper into your ears my beautiful pile and number three spirit guides my garden angel archangel michael mahar so what is there okay so you got oh you got the temperance beautiful you got the five of wands you got the star wow <laughs> you got the knight of cups you got the seven of sword and oh my goodness you got the world okay hmm. i can definitely see my darling seven of sword means a separation a fighting moment when you guys are like feeling that you don't know them completely or they don't know you completely so miscommunication can happen in your relationship so work on the communication skills okay misunderstanding can happen due to miscommunication okay but that is really just a steamy part because this bad part this bad part will lead you to the amazing amazing passionate part of your life okay that's amazing why let me tell you one thing every time you guys are having any kind of very little misunderstanding or very little miscommunication very little jealousy oh my god that really makes a different kind of scenarios in your life and gives you the hottest time ever and you got a very weird luck my group number 3 that your person is someone they feel like that you're not telling everything to them okay look they they will give you of course they will give you space but sometimes it feels like they need to know everything in your life so that they can protect you so they will be like a mommy or a daddy type that they need to know all the important stuff in your life so that they know that you're protected okay it's not that they are not giving you space but it's like that they're doing it out of responsibility that really comes to them innately okay they don't need to adopt that quality it really comes naturally to them so your person feels like that no you're not telling me everything where did you go what did you buy that this thing or that thing so yeah things like that and 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 look at that it's really ended up in the bed like that okay let me tell you one thing your person will whisper into your ears first thing whenever like they are at the peak of their passion they will tell you that you are mine okay you are mine your soul your body your love your affection everything is mine i am so selfish i am so self centered when it comes to you i cannot share you i cannot 
lose you i i cannot see you with anybody else i'm so obsessed with you i don't know if it if it is good or bad i just don't know that how to how to live without you i feel so drawn to you i'm so addicted to your energy i'm so addicted to your smell i'm so addicted to your smile i'm so much into you even at the point of time when i'm working i i i'm i'm hearing your voice inside my head i can hear that you are talking to me inside my head you always live in my thought live in my head so my group number 3 i can feel definitely you are someone like unconsciously you're going to be putting a love spell on your future spouse but how things happen my darling sometimes unconsciously we put a spell on the another person how okay the question is how you can put a spell unconsciously so when you think or when you are having a vision board in your mind constantly you are like seeing you're imagining in your fantasy world that your person is thinking about you your person is obsessed with you your person is addicted towards you your person is loves you they got only eyes on you they are yours nobody can take your place in their heart constantly when you imagine things like that then unconsciously my darling you are putting that obsession spell on your future spouse and you will see that things will manifest through their um responsibility through their concern for you or through their action and you will see that happening in the real world okay pile number 3 you will see that your person feels so so loved and so much happy whenever you are giving them attention the star card your person just wants to give you the best life experience like they love to massage you they love to feed you they love to give you things they will whisper you that what you want next okay also your future spouse will tell you that whisper something into my ears like they will tell you that whisper things in my ears my darling okay also my darling i can feel that your person will say that that oh that um okay <laughs> did you put a spell on me definitely your person will whisper that thing okay into into your ears that did you put a spell on me or what did you do to me why i cannot stop thinking about you okay like you are constantly in my mind and these things will stay Okay it's not only for a small amount of time my darling whoever watching my video my pile number 3 this kind of attraction or attention will stay until the day comes when you guys are leaving the earth okay yes definitely the world is here my darling oh my god both of you definitely your person is in love with your body shape they just love your body so much it feels like they have never seen that beautiful sculpture anywhere like your body it feels like you you got an angelic body whoever you are male female doesn't matter they just love it okay they just love it and if you are like no i i'm not so beautiful like that i you don't see yourself as beautiful as your person sees you okay oh my god so definitely they will tell you that don't hide from me or don't feel shy to tell me things okay i want you to open your heart only for me okay don't tell your secret desire to anybody i'm here to help you if you need any okay yeah they will whisper very little things and very cute things okay oh god you got the spontaneity you move beyond the constraints of the mind and freely lovingly embrace the new situations Oh my goodness you person will be very much spontaneous the Sagittarius Leo Aries Scorpio Capricorn energy okay and also Aquarius energy is here because i can see the Aquarius is here group number 3 spontaneity your person will feel that spontaneity in you and spon and continuously they will shower you with their love and affection yeah it will happen definitely you are watching you are listening you are you are listening to pile number 3 and 
There is nothing called coincidence. Things will happen for you. That's why my darling, sometimes the good is hidden. Maybe you cannot see the good right now in your current situation because it is hidden from you and there is a reason that you cannot know and, and I don't know, okay? So what is there in this connection, this relationship? Oh my God, yes, there is vision. No matter what, you see the bigger picture of a loving, just universe. Yes. Yes, my final number three, your vision board, whatever you imagine, whatever you dream, that comes true crazily. So my darling, whatever you are dreaming something, be very careful about your dreams. Because you, your imagination, your dreams can come true like magic, like... Oh my god and spontaneity is here oh my god in this connection there is so much adventures love and spontaneity what's there more in this connection the judge wow your person will be very fair with you they're very fair okay they believe in fairness they're very having like libra energy they're fair with you they're fair with themselves so if you are doing something wrong they will correct you or if they have done something wrong and at the point of time you're correcting them, they will listen to you. So this person will admit their own faults and try to correct their mistakes. Try to learn from their mistakes. In this connection, things will happen like that. that if they have done something or if they will do something that will hurt you, your person will change their perspective so that they won't hurt you next time. They're the king. Okay, they're authoritative, they're powerful. In this relationship, they will be dominant. They will be protector, responsible. Okay, they will provide things for you. They will protect you, love you. The king, they are in the power. Also, the king talks about that they are the boss. Authoritative, powerful. You will love to get dominated by them. DDLG, daddy, dom, little girl. This is your <laughs> connection, my daddy. Okay, or maybe um, mommy, dom, little boy these things can happen okay like daddy mommy energy your person got them so okay also you got the vision okay it's not a coincidence my darling that you got the vision card twice look at that vision and the vision so and i told you about the vision that whatever you will see and whatever you will try to imagine in your third eye in your imagination in your daydreaming Things will happen exactly the way. So my group number three, pay attention to your imagination. Pay attention to your dreams that you're having with your open eyed. Because that is going to affect your life like nobody else. Okay. The vision also lots of psychic witches, powerful people who are very much able to manifest things quickly. Watching my video, you are having this power. Also... Secretly, your person got that power in them. So I got the owl, nighttime, nocturnal animal, like hidden secrets. You can see things very quickly. Your person can see things very quickly that you guys are having some secrets. That's why, my darling, you cannot hide any secret from your person because they got the vibe exactly. You got it, okay? Like both of you are like owls. If someone is really hiding any secrets, other one will know and ask that, okay, you're hiding something. Let me Let me know what you're hiding. And the vision, my darling, have a very big vision for your life. Because let me tell you, things are about to be exactly like your imagination. So don't you feel scared to dream big. Because it's time for you to imagine a big life and dream about a very big, romantic, positive dream. Okay? Yes, fairy tales are real. Okay, yes, Disney fairy tales are real. Yes, you can have a fairy tale life if you believe in magic yes things are really magical if you believe in it okay so don't confuse your imagination into real world and don't change your dreams based on the real world because you can really make your dreams in real okay so this is all i got for you my beautiful pile number three i hope you enjoyed this reading okay subscribe to my channel hit that bell icon if you haven't already till then stay blessed and happy i love you my darling so much